Hi, I'm Brian Van from SportBikeTrackview.com. Today we're going to do a video review on the Speedy Venture H2 Out 3 layer 4 season jacket. Let's start off with a note on size. 5 feet 11 inches tall, about 200 pounds, with a somewhat athletic build. I'm wearing a size extra large in the Venture, and I do have all of the liners in the coat right now. Front view, side, good mobility, back view, Good mobility, still good sleeve length even when I'm reaching out, everything is as it should be. While we're talking about size, when you get a jacket like this that has multiple inner liners, okay, in my opinion, the fit of the coat, when you have the liners in it, you should notice the coat a little bit with all the liners. And I do right now, it's a little snug for me in the forearms, right, a little bit across the shoulders and the, the chest when I move around, it's not bad, but when I take those liners out, there's a lot of extra volume inside the jacket, okay? And the fit becomes perfect, absolutely perfect. Don't notice it at all, okay? Think about it. If the jacket's a little on the big side with the two liners in and you remove them, and all you're left with is the shell, it's going to be really big on you, okay? You'll be able to dial it in a bit with the volume adjusters. We've got two here in the arm and one here in the waist, which you need when you remove the liners from a jacket like this. But just think that through in the sizing process, right? When am I going to use it most? What do I want it to fit like? And just take a minute, pull the liners out, and try it on. And I think that's a, a reasonable piece of advice. This jacket comes with CE certified armor in the elbows, forearms, and shoulders. It has optional armor available for the back and the chest. The speedy jackets don't come with any back protector, no phone, no nothing, no false sense of security. They give you the ability to choose the back protector that's right for you. The example I have here is their CE certified warrior piece. We'll cover it more in the second part. And here's their warrior chest. Both a la carte. This jacket is a three-layer jacket, multi-season, four-season jacket for many. The innermost is a 250 gram aluminized body warming liner. It's got some unique features to it. Stay tuned for the second part. We'll break those down in detail. The next step up is the Speedy H2O waterproof breathable membrane. The two innermost liners can be used together as a standalone waterproof insulated jacket. Add some, some value to this whole deal. The outermost is the shell. This is made from the 10X polyamide textile. It's got a nice hand, very nice hand to it. It's abrasion resistant, it's strong, it's tough. It also has some 10x some motion panels. You see some here, back of the shoulder. It just helps the jacket move better on your body, and that's a good feature, a good benefit when you have a coat with multiple inner liners like this. Ventilation. When you have the two liners removed, you're riding, it's warm, it's a hot day, you're out having some fun. You've got vents here in the arms. Top of the shoulders, great places to do it, and then exhaust vents on the back. Cover this in more detail in the second part. The arm vents are unique, right? In that they have a little shock cord that helps keep them held open to drive more air into the jacket for circulation. We showed you the volume adjusters. We've got two waterproof storage pockets here, water resistant storage pockets here. There's some pockets inside the jacket and another here in the sleeve. Also compatible with the speedy safety lamp that can go on the back of the coat, okay? Stay tuned for the second part. I think we've done a pretty decent job introducing it to you. If you're interested in this coat, you're really going to be interested in the second half of this video. I'm going to tear this thing apart, give you a high-level look from the inside out, and really break it down. All right, here we go with the Speedy Venture H2O Four Season Jacket. As always, we're going to start with the armor that comes in it, Force Tech CE. Certified, soft shell, proprietary to Speedy. This is the shoulder piece here. We have the elbow and forearm piece. Remember, the Speedy jackets do not come with any type of back protection. They don't put foam in there to give you a false sense of security. They want to give you the ability to choose the back protector that's right for your intended application. The ones that we recommend most often are going to be the Warrior Back Protector CE Certified. Very moldable, comfortable, super lightweight, channeling for airflow. Buy this when you buy the jacket, put it in the same box. You can also accept the chest protection, Warrior chest protection, same technology, very slim line, lightweight, channeling here to maintain a pocket of air and keep you cool. 
three layer jacket. We're going to start with the 250 gram aluminized insulating layer. Okay. Look at what they've done here in the armpit area. That's a hot spot. Even when it's cold out and you've got a jacket like this, that is still a hot spot. By allowing the air to circulate in and out of there, it's going to keep that area more regulated. Okay. Regulated means comfortable. Got a nice comfort fabric here around the high neck. Feels really good. Got a snap pocket here on the right side of the jacket. This snaps inside of their H2 out membrane. Okay. You put these two together, even when removed from the jacket here, they can be used as a standalone jacket. So that adds a little value to this whole deal for sure. Here is their H2 out waterproof, breathable, proprietary stuff from Speedy. Okay. It has a shock cord around the waist, right? So you can dial the fit in around the waist. It keeps the wind and water out when it's blowing. Got a nice zipper pull to it. Got some adjustments here. Cuff of the sleeve as well to dial will fit in there. Now let's get down to the shell of the jacket. Polyamide Tanax fabric, right? Abrasion resistant, protective, and it's got a nice hand to it. I'll say that. Speedy logo screen printed across the back of the shoulders in a reflective. That's cool. This jacket has the ability to accept their safety lamp for night riding. If you want to do that, you put it across here. It's like a neon thing. It'll, you know, LED deal. You know, alert people that you're out there. Zippered exhaust vents right here, both sides of the jacket. Locking zippers. Got our volume adjuster here. This is not quite a, a true three-quarter jacket, pretty close, but they have the volume adjusters a little higher on the waist. It dials the fit in better, in my opinion. We've got Tenax stretch fabric here in the back of the shoulders and underarms. It allows the jacket to move well on your body when you have all three layers in it. That was a good call. Some more reflective piping here on the arm. Here is the arm vent. This is a special design that they've used here in the arm vent. By having this drawstring, you're, you're able to A, pull it closed with your gloves on. And another thing it does, if you look at it, right, having that string there actually holds this vent open, turns it into a scoop, drives air to the jacket. Good design. Volume adjusters here in the arms. Two levels of adjustment. We've got D-ring, textile and Velcro, pretty standard issue stuff. You need to have these volume adjusters in the jacket when you remove the inner layers. It allows you to dial the fit of the exterior shelling to make it fit you as best as it can. Here in the cuff, got a zipper. It's a locking zipper. Metal snap. All top quality stuff here from our friends at Speedy. There is a storage pocket here on the left arm with a tag that warns you this is not waterproof, okay? Not a waterproof pocket, but a great place to store things when the weather is good. Pocket up here, left breast. This is also not waterproof. Spring-loaded metal snaps, good quality stuff. Now we get down to this pocket, absolutely waterproof. We've got a storm flap, we have a zipper, and two metal snaps. Waterproof pocket, there's going to be one on each side of the jacket. Another intake vent up here in the collarbone, the shoulder area. It's scoop style, right? Drive air into the coat. Speedy reflective logo and piping across the chest on the left side. High collar, there is your snap. Adjustable collar, okay? Just slide the male end through the channel until it grabs the appropriate detent, and there you go, there's your adjustment. Mirror image of the vent. Some more reflectives, another pocket here, remember not waterproof, but the one just below it is absolutely waterproof. You get into the shell of the jacket from the inside out. Here are the snap attachments for the chest protector. You're going to find those on either side. The chest protector that works with this jacket has the male end of the snaps. They snap right in. It's a good call. Amps up the safety in this jacket quite a bit. Storage pocket here on the left side towards the base of the jacket. Got snaps in place to keep everything in there nice and secure while you're riding. Back protection, installation. There is a pocket right here in the back of the jacket. Open the snaps, slides right in. Nice Velcro patches, hold it in place, keep it comfortable and tidy. Like I said, you barely notice it. These jackets come with the adjustable groin straps, okay? These go through the groin to keep the jacket down and in place nicely. They can be easily removed. You choose to do so, got a quick release click right there. Shock cord around the waist so you can dial the fit in around the waist when you have the jacket in. 
keep the inclement weather out as you're going. What do we think? This is another great high-end touring adventure style riding do-all jacket, right? I mean, you could use this on a number of different bikes. Top quality, heirloom style quality, really. You're going to buy something like this. You're going to have it for years and years and years. It's an investment that will pay dividends over and over because a good jacket just makes the ride better. It's, it's really that simple. We like it quite a bit. This is the Speedy Venture H2O jacket. I'm Brian Van from SportbikeTrackGear.com.